let's talk about a guy his age, um, his stardom, because he's going to the Hall of Fame when he's done. No doubt about it. The U.S. But Hall of Fame or the Big Boy Hall of Fame? The, the U.S. <laughs> the U.S. Hockey Hall of Fame. Uh, whether he gets, you know, enough recognition for the other one, I, you know, I don't know. Um, but, but I'll say this. If you're a general manager of a team and you are building a team and you want uh, to play a certain style um, and that style, um, um, well, that, that particular player and okay, we'll use Zach. Uh, what is Zach, right? Zach um, was a top six forward, forward four years and deserved, deservingly so. Um, was he a top six player on this team? No, is your answer. Because you have Fiala, and you have Kaprizov, um, and you have other parts. So, um, does he fit in your bottom six? Well, that all depends on what you want on your bottom mm -hmm. six. Okay? Um, do you want him to be the same play, uh, the same type of player he was? Do you want him to be more of a checking forward? Do you, you know, uh, and, and is that player who has had that much stardom going to be able to accept a role like that? And how is it going to affect the team? Um, uh, or do you want somebody in there that, okay, has not had the career that he has, but brings you something that is more relevant to the um, to the the way you want to play, and is he going to help contribute to winning? Mm -hmm. Now, that is what is going to face them this summer, and uh, whether they believe going forward, he is a guy that we want to have on our team to win a Stanley Cup, and it's really hard to talk about. Because you're, you're talking about a guy who um, has, you know, had a wonderful career. Um, you know, it's unfortunate that father time catches up with everybody. And this organization has shown that it is there to do one thing, and that is to win a Stanley Cup. Not to make the playoffs, not to get through, you know, um, get, uh, you know, just get through a, a one, round one. They are there to win it. And unfortunately, in this business, um, uh, when it comes to uh, owing somebody, that's out the, mm -hmm. out the door, out the window. It's hard to talk about. It's hard to accept. Imagine being a guy who, who, who was a superstar mm -hmm. in his day, being told that you're going to play a lesser role, mm -hmm. Uh, that you're going to play seven to 10 minutes a night, that you are going to get the odd power play. Um, if he is okay with that and everyone is on the same page. And I said this two to three months ago when he got benched, <laughs> sit him down, talk to him, have an understanding and say, you know, is this something that you can accept? Um, we think you can play a role. Um, then go ahead with it. Apparently, you know, their, their communication is not great. Mm -hmm. And um, they're gonna have to figure it out one way or the other.